What's going on everyone? Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going over eccentric training and how you can add this to your workouts. We're gonna go over a variety of exercises to help you break through your plateaus and also get you stronger for these exercises. The first exercise we're gonna cover is the pull-up. Then we're gonna move over to the uh, dips. Then we're gonna go over the pistol squat. And lastly, the pike press. These four exercises share one thing in common, that is that they're compound exercises. Compound exercises build the most muscle and also help you develop a better physique. The pull-up, for example, is a great exercise to develop your back, your biceps, your forearms, and also your grip strength. It's honestly one of my favorite exercises to do because there's nothing like pulling your weight over an object. So make sure you keep adding this into your workout routine. Pull-ups are by no means an easy exercise. So when doing the exercise correctly, make sure that you're not doing this exactly what I'm demonstrating in this video. Notice how I'm shrugging my shoulders up and I'm flaring my elbows out. Make sure you keep them down the whole time and just work on eccentrics. Eccentrics are great to help you build strength for the actual pull-up. Notice here how I'm slowing down the movement. I'm jumping up towards the bar and then slowly lowering myself down on a five count. If you can only do a three count, then I suggest starting with that and then slowly building on to like a five or even an eight second negative to help you build strength for the pull-up. It's also going to help you uh, get more repetitions in the future. So make sure you continue to add that. The pike press is another one of my favorite exercises to help develop strength in the shoulders, the triceps, and just overall body awareness. Notice here how I'm piking into the exercise by pressing my hips up and then leaning forward. That forward lean is going to help you develop a tremendous amount of strength in your shoulders and your triceps. So when you're doing this exercise, make sure you're leaning far forward like a tripod and then pausing at the bottom and then slowly lowering yourself down. This is gonna have tremendous carryover for your overhead press and it'll make you a lot stronger for other pushing exercises in the future. The pistol squat is a great lower body exercise in the calisthenics world. Now, if you're into doing body weight exercises, which I highly recommend, the pistol squat is a must and you must learn how to properly do this one. When performing the exercise, make sure that you're actually sitting back into your hips when doing this exercise and prevent your back from rounding too much. Just focus on keeping tension on your abdominal muscles and your lower body and you should be okay. Now, if you lack the flexibility of this exercise, then I suggest you try a shrimp squat as this was going to help you progress into this exercise. Remember, we want quality repetitions when doing any skill or any exercise in our program. So check your ego when you do anything and just remember that quality is always going to be better than quantity. Parallel bar dips are great for developing your chest, your shoulders, and your triceps. It is a harder exercise if you don't have the uh, shoulder flexibility or even chest mobility when doing the dips. This is why I highly recommend doing eccentric training for the dip. Slowing down the exercise is actually going to recruit more muscle fibers and put a lot more tension on your shoulders and your chest, allowing you to create more flexibility in the future. So remember, three to five seconds on the way down, pause for a brief second, then slowly lower your feet down to the ground and rinse and repeat for however many reps you want to accomplish. Continue to do this guys and you will see tremendous gains in your workouts. All right, everyone, I hope you found this video helpful. If you liked it, make sure to hit the thumbs up. Also make sure to subscribe. And if you're having a hard time creating your own workout routine and hit a plateau, check out my new heroic strength program that is out now. It's actually in the description box below. So hit that link and go check it out and start training like a superhero. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.